Hey Max, hey guys, um, I'm pretty much done with this at this stage with the, with the eye polyface of this character, okay? Um, so he's wearing boots, jeans, uh, some military shirt uh, kind of thing, uh, a, a vest, a, some gloves, and some hat and headphones, as you can see. Now, uh, I have a few questions that need answering before I go and retop this and make this uh, and push this forward onto the pipeline, okay? Uh, is the player going to equip several stuff at runtime? I'm not talking about weapons, I'm talking about clothing and stuff. Is he going to equip several stuff, like headphones, gloves, uh, hats, uh, that type of stuff? Or are we just doing the vests and the backpacks? I think we agreed to that, just vests and backpacks, right? And if that's the case, what I'm going to be delivering is this guy here, okay? And then I will deliver the, the vest and the backpack separately so that they can be rigged to the same skeleton. Now, uh, the thing is, if I deliver a guy like this, they will never be able to remove the hat or remove the phones. This is just what they will have to use. Okay? Uh, obviously, I will make different characters. So, another character, and I will use probably the same face, but then I'll put some glasses on and change the clothing and whatever, and they will have another character. And, and, and like that, we're going to have several characters, but as we export them, they're going to always be looking like that. So they're going to use just Soldier 1, Soldier 2, Soldier 3, like a set pack of, of, of looks that, that, we can, that we can deliver to them. So that's what's going to happen if just that uh, is going to be uh, sent forward. Now, uh, also another thing that I'm, that I'm thinking is, are we not complicating this too much? At the end of the day, uh, what's uh, the, the good thing about having different tiers and, and different stuff is that um, when a player gets uh, an upgrade, he can actually visualize it, right? Uh, but in our game, you won't be able to visualize it at all because if, even if he gets tier 2 uh, vest, you won't be able to see it on him because we're just using the arms for the first person. So. If the player can't see it unless, well, he's going to obviously look at the UI and he's going to see that he has more armor, uh, that he's more resistant to fire or to explosions or to whatever. Uh, also, with the backpack, he will see he has more inventory, but he never see the art uh, part of it. He will never see the backpack itself because he's just looking forward to his arms, right? He will see it on the third-person characters, but those are really irrelevant. Who cares what type of bag he's, he's using? I mean, on how it looks. Obviously, you care for the loot that he might have, and you've got to go there, and that's not going to change the loot, but how it looks. I mean, I remember Rust when he started, um, the third-person guns were all the same. Like, no matter if you had the M4, the, the shotgun, or whatever, there was only one gun there. And, and that made it very simple for us to do third-person animations and, and, and all the rest. Like, everything was just simplified. Uh, for a game that is going to go to Kickstarter to, to, just to present a vertical slice of what we want to do and to get some funding, uh, maybe we are complicating this too much. Maybe all we need is just uh, one vest, one backpack. We use the same method, so we export the character, but we have one vest and one backpack. And that's just what you will see. Obviously, there will, have, there will be three um, in code because they will have different characteristics. Some of them will be stronger than others and, and take more weight or whatever. But, uh, but we would have the one mesh. Okay? Uh, it's a suggestion. Uh, it doesn't need to be this one. This is quite simple. I could make one that is a bit more complex, like the, the, the tier 2 one. And we will always use that one. For the player, it doesn't make any difference because he's never going to see them. He's just going to see them on someone else's. And, and that's not relevant. Like, it, uh, who cares if the other guy has tier 1 or tier 2 vest in terms of looks? It's a vest there. You know? Uh, and obviously for me, it would simplify, it would accelerate things. Instead of making three vests and three backpacks, I would just make the one, right? Um, and I could focus on making more variety of characters. So uh, I don't know what you think about this, but, um, but it's really questions I need to get answered. Most of all, and most important is, is the only thing that we're going to change on the character is the backpack and the vest. And if that's the case, then I, I will deliver full characters like I'm doing now. This will be the first one. Um, Okay. Hope to hear your opinions. Thanks a lot.